get it with another one of these any chart videos from Mr. Anime World. This one's called How Anime Characters Got Into Isekai. And to be honest, even if there's stuff that we haven't seen in anime yet, I don't think it's really spoilers. So I don't think it really matters. Let's get it. First one. <laughs> Natsuki Subaru, which I assume is the main character of ReZero. And apparently, he just blinked. He blinked and he was in an isekai. Got it? Next one. Katarina Krayas. We know this one, right? From last last time we once saw one of his videos. That was the girl with the actual harm of herself. Trukun. It was the menacing signs. Next one. Oh! Osamu Daza. Hey, isekai shikaku. Also Trukun. And Kumo Desuka was blown up with classmate. And like... And not wrong, you know? Like, if you've seen the actual episode explanation of what happened, it's kind of like that, right? Next up, Toka Mimori from Failure Frame that we're watching right now. Yeah, he just got summoned by the shitty goddess. And remember, look at the goddess. Goddess has golden eyes. Demon Lord Essence. Next up, Ernesti Chevalier was here by Karkun. This is Night and Magic. Next. Yuri Shibuya from Kyokara Mao. His head was dipped in the toilet. Bro got isekai while getting a swirly. <laughs> the toilet literally just summoned him to a different dimension. I wonder how that worked. Like, did he die? Or does the toilet like a way of transporting? Next one. Sora and Shiro. They were invited, right? Defeating the gods game. God in the game. Uh, it was a game of chess, was it? Wait a minute. Didn't they win? And like, it enticed the god to be like, holy shit, you're good, so I'm gonna invite you in. Right? They were summoned in. Did they... They defeated god in the game. Okay, my bad. I thought, I thought it said they were defeated by god. No, 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 this is correct. They defeated a god. Yes, yes, yes. Now Fumi, shield hero baby, was summoned. Yeah, there's... Now Fumi, Iwatami, there is... Is there anything that really... In the intro shit, when we got summoned, is there any lore before that? No. They just got summoned, and then it was like, oh, immediately he was already getting shit on because he's a shield hero. Next one. Boxo was hit by... <laughs> right. This is the reincarnated as a, a vending machine. Actually, a great anime. Great slice of life, funny anime. Genuinely. If you haven't seen it, you can't talk shit. I've seen like four or five episodes and I had to drop it because you guys didn't watch. But those episodes I did watch, they were fun, self-contained little stories. Truly. Really. But he he did get hit by a vending machine. Like, I think the, answer, the, the logic was like, he was on a motorcycle and there was a vending machine carrying, a, a truck carrying a vending machine in front of him. And he was like looking at the vending machine so much that he got distracted or some shit and then he got crashed into it or something like that. I forget. Next up, we have... Hiraku Machio died of an illness from farming life in another world. Wait, this is the dude that has like 500 girls in the harem, right? Next up, from how not to summon a demon lord, we have Diablo. Bro got summoned, and now he has a huge harem as well. Next anime, in another world with my star smartphone, hey, Isekai! Toya Mochizuki was accidentally killed by God. What do you mean, accidentally killed by God? And then the God killed him and he's like, Ah, oh, shit. My bad. Well, here's your superpower. You can keep your iPhone. Next up. The wrong way to use healing magic. Oh, yeah, summoned. It was very interesting. He got accidentally summoned, right? Ken Usato. The logic of, like, how the heroes get summoned in that series is they need to be, like, really high-achieving people of significance. And the two people, the student council prez and the other person... They were elites, but Ken Usato was just a normie, and he got summoned, and then he got dragged in with it, right? Because they were sharing an umbrella, and then, like, and then they felt bad for him. They're like, oh, I'm sorry that you got dragged into this shit. Next up. Skimishi Moon Fantasy was kidnapped by a goddess. Is this correct? Kidnapped by a goddess, huh? Kidnapping. The word kidnapping is very intentional. Hmm. That first episode was a crazy one. There's a lot of shit going on with the goddess of, of course, you know, the Isekai world, but as well with the moon god of our world and stuff like that. But yeah, great anime. 
Fuck the goddess. She's so hot, though. Well, I don't know if she's actually that hot. We don't see her eyes, right? They never show us their face. But, like, you know, I wonder. Next up, Mushoku Tensei. Rudy's great rat hit by truck kun. Is that true? Wasn't he... Why am I assuming he got stabbed? Because it was in front of the 7-Eleven where Nanahoshi was there, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. And the truck couldn't hit. Got it, got it, got it. Next up. Itsuki Kawasumi, shield hero, was hit by... No. No! This is Loki spoiling, but I don't care because we're not watching shield hero anymore. And I doubt we'll ever watch it again because people don't care, but no. Actually, lore accurate. He got hit by a garbage truck of all things. This guy fucking sucks. The way that he treated that martial artist girl, bro, bro, he fucking sucks. So does the, all the other heroes, to be honest. But like, he got hit by a garbage truck. That's hilarious. Next up, Parallel World Pharmacy, Pharma de Medicis. Bro's name is, well, I don't know, friends, but I'm going to assume that it's something like Medicine Pharmacy. Pharmacy of Medicine or something, I don't know. Died of overwork. Got it. He was like a salary man. Next isekai. Saga of Tanya the Evil was hit by Trainkun. Another isekai that we haven't watched yet. A lot of people say great things about this show. One of these days. One of these days, Tanya will make it in. Next. Slime Taushite 300 Nen. Azusa Aizawa died of overwork. Another cute uh, girl. I don't know. It's like a salary woman. You know, got died of overwork. Next up, the world's finest assassin. Bro got. That's right. He got killed by. <laughs> killed by airplane. <laughs> it's more specific than that. But obviously, he's saying it in a way it doesn't. It's funny to say that because it's not wrong. It's kind of wrong, right? Because, like, he was on an airplane and he basically got betrayed by his own organization that thought that he was a liability because he was retiring. But still, it's, it's kind of funny. Airplane kun. Next up. The Great Cleric was killed by a revolver gun. <laughs> he actually just got shot? Really? In Japan? They had a random shooter in the loose? And he got shot? Interesting. That's pretty rare, right? Next up. Kamikatsu, the CGI horror anime. <laughs> it's not a horror anime, but it was CGI horror. Uh, was sacrificed. Sacrificed by what? How did he get sacrificed? What did that happen here? Next up. My unique skill makes me OP even at level 1. Oh my god, that is the most generic fucking isekai light novel title that I definitely fucking watched. Fell off a monster as a loot. What? Fell off a monster as a loot? Is how you got isekai'd? He was a fucking monster drop? Bro is a literal loot? Alright. Next up. Ascendance of a bookworm was crushed by a book. <laughs> Dude. How do you get crushed by a book? You just did a library? It's like a giant fucking 5,000 pound book fell on you? Like, how does that work? Next up, Tensura was killed by Knife Chan. That's right. I hope our friend Tamura deleted her hard drive, but yes, knife attack in the broad daylight. Next up, Instant Death was summoned. Um, Bus went through a tunnel and then we were in another world. I don't, did they ever explain it? I'm not sure, but uh, we, I, I guess he did get summoned, right? That bus was summoned through that tunnel. Next up. The world of Ultimate Games is tough for mobs. Bro fell down a pair of stairs, exactly. Down these stairs. Oh my god, this is a One Piece meme. This is a literal One Piece meme. This is supposed to be the Zoro flashback. Or I think her name is Queena or some shit. <laughs> where the rival childhood friend died falling down the stairs. So Zoro says, I'll, for, I'll, I'll become like the number one swordsman. <laughs> Leon for Barto Farto. <laughs> Fell down these stairs, that's right. After playing Ultimate Games all day. Shield Hero! Oh! Motoyasu! Yandere? What the fuck? This is so interesting! 
The arrow hero got killed by a fucking dumpster truck. This dude got killed by two yandere? All right. Next up, Mondaiji received an invitation. Sounds like a game. Next, the eighth son. Are you kidding me? It's not quite, you know, seventh prince, but it's the eighth son. Just fell asleep. My man fell asleep and then got fucking reincarnated into a younger kid. All right. Next up, Eminence and Shadow was hit by truck. No. He forced... No, 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 no. I thought that he intentionally ran out into traffic. That was my understanding. I thought that he was so meta with Isekai that what he was doing was like hitting his head against a rock to hype himself up, then running into traffic because he knew that's the way to get Isekai'd. But actually, the actual story why he was doing that was he was like chasing after magic. He was like in this delirious state of like seeking greater power and then he saw a head beam light in the traffic and he thought that he was like getting closer to magic and then he got hit by the traffic then he died <laughs> but yeah there it is Sid Kagano next up Baki Gaiden what wait a dude gets reincarnate what Baki has re isekai reincarnation Baki Gaiden, Retsu Kaiyo Isekai, was killed by Katana Kun, then he got reincarnated? What the fuck? That's random? Okay. One day we'll watch Baki. Iruma Kun! Mairimashita Iruma Kun, welcome to Demon School Academy. I adore this series, man. Was sold to a demon. That's right. Shitty parents. Well, I think that the true nature will be like a plot twist, right? Because, like, in the anime, our parents are trash. They made Iruma do so many things to the point where he became like a dodge god. <laughs> and now uh, his parents sold him off for money. But that's what we're led to believe. And looking at Iruma's lineage and how, you know, like the past demon lord resembles him. It, there's a bunch of shit. I have to go back and actually do a rewatch to understand again. But like, I think there's more to meets the eye than just sold off to a demon. Next up, Sato Kazuma. Konosuba, that's right. This is possibly one of the most pathetic ways to <laughs> reincarnate. <laughs> Died from fear of beating... Not a truck. This was a tractor. So a girl was walking by and he thought that he was being slick trying to save her from a truck. But it was actually a tractor going at like 2 miles per hour. And then he died from the fear of it. Pissed his pants and died. And is that it? <laughs> and that's it. That's another chart. Funny chart from Mr. <clears throat> Anime World. Guys, please go like the video. Go sub to his channel if you haven't. I do love... I don't know how much of this is fact and reality. At the end of the day, it's all just for good fun. And reading this shit like this is always just fun to do. 